Insatiably. Yeah. yeah, and eating garbage, junk, nothing in nutritional value. None of that has worked to my benefit. Yeah, so it won't, it won't even fulfill you if that's what you're doing. Mm-hmm. And today I was just like, if I don't go to the gym, I'm going to lose my life. You couldn't have even gotten that much in the gym, though, just from, that I was only like 15 I minutes. Only burned, I only burned like 150 calories. That's a lot for that short amount of time, though. It's not. Normally I burn. Oh man, you must have just ran there and just went all beastly. Yeah, I turned all the resistance into weight out. What right. exercise are we talking? It's not running. It's like an elliptical style. Oh, like a rower? A rower kind of? It's like running, almost. Okay. It's, a, it's like a pedal. It's almost like the, a cathode point between a treadmill and a bike. It's an elliptical. Okay. And, yeah. 
man. I've never been to a gym. I'd, I'd like to if, really? my, if my body gets, you know, You more should. I'll, I mean, I would yeah. love to. I'd love to work out. I'd love I'm subscribed to exercise. What one do you want? I think it's my father has me on a family plan. So I go there out of convenience. But Planet Fitness was the one where I first. Is it near your house? I was at the mall. Oh, okay. I know it's a big extension building. Yeah. So, um, I mean, when you were talking about this earlier, though, I mean, I guess this is, I'm seeing that this is a much deeper yeah. issue for you than I first realized. And yeah. if I don't, you know, I don't want to be seen. Yeah. I don't want to be, um, yeah, it's very deep. Well, I mean, that, that being the case and the fact that we're going to be, you know, working together a lot and possibly getting in front of together, I just want to. I guess I want to know. Know more about that. Know, know more about what I what I must avoid. What what I should avoid to. Like I mean, bef I guess I'm I'm not going to do the whole let's take photos thing. That's something that well, I've learned that we, you don't like. We actually can do photos. Okay. If I'm feeling. Okay. Comfortable. But I'll let you be the one to suggest it. Okay. Okay. Exactly. And also, there's also things like I keep throwing snacks at you when you come over here. Yeah. And I mean. It's not your fault though. Oh, uh, yeah, but I'd like to know what you prefer. Oftentimes I'm hungry. Yeah, um, so but I can get a different type of snack. I can get pita and celery and hummus, I mean, if, if that's something. That also I sounds really more satisfying and very really refreshing. I really appreciate that, yeah, because yeah. it's more filling. I don't know if it's more filling, chips but the... Chips and salsa, uh, for some reason I get carried away with them, and it's very high in salsa. It sounds heavy and nasty when you think about it them. It is, yeah, yeah. when you think about how your body's digested. My father today, I was hungry when I got off from work. And it's hungry and tired, but mm -hmm. I was like, I'm gonna try to sneak a nap, and that's why I messaged you. I was like, All right, I'm gonna take some time, okay. do my online bill pays for the things I need to pay off my credit card, and also, yeah, because I've been swiping my credit card to survive my my okay, yeah. super drafted. Oh damn! And so I just got paid today for one week. So Looking today. good. Pretty decent. Yeah, Not what, bad what for is one it? one week for one week's worth of pay for 40 hours. I made 400. Dude, I damn. Take the taxes. So that means bi weekly I could bring home a little over 800. Which in a month that's 1600, which is able to pay off all the Wow. That sounds that's great. Yeah. That's more than I would have expected from that kind of setup. Yeah, the call center is, uh, they pay $12 an hour. Damn. That's middle, middle wage. Middle, middle wage, Medium, yeah. yeah. The most I've ever made was $18 when I was cutting down trees. Yeah, you told me that, but that's not it's worth not it, that extra not bit. Not worth the extra bit. Although it was an adventure. It was because it was a test of all of my... Yeah, but it's a temporary it's worth it thing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. not in the long run. If you do it long term, you see these guys who've been there 20 years and their bodies are just broken now. Your mind and your body. Yeah, your mind too, especially. You learn so many cool things out there in that environment. Like I, I imagine. Like, like just putting a notch into a tree and back cutting it and seeing it fall over. A tree yeah. that's a hundred. Is that satisfying? That's, that's real. It's like man, the it's, ASMR. It's, it's, the <laughs> it's the most. Yeah, man, yeah, yeah. It's the most. Yeah. yeah. And then you like push the tree over and you have this control and it just slams. Mm. And you feel the the earth beneath you. Interesting. It's a very yeah. And having this chainsaw gives you so much power. It's like oh, a yeah, you're weapon. working with a chainsaw, huh? It's like huh? your weapon, your instrument. Yeah. Damn. You have to have hearing protection, eye protection. I don't know if I told you, but um, it was it was really scary. The, the day before I moved out of my old apartment into Michael's house, um, I was actually in Chesapeake, and I had a splinter come and land in my eye. Oh. And it scratched my cornea. So the Man, lucky that it wasn't worse. It could have been way worse. Totally. Because the chainsaw itself is. You it know, flew off that. Yeah. The belt. Into yeah. my eye. Damn. And that it freaked me out. It, it landed like the thorn was in my eye, scratched my cornea. What about safety goggles? Um. Yeah, I, I think <laughs> I think it broke in the Damn. Because I wasn't wearing them that day. Okay. But there were instances where sawdust would, even while wearing them, would get behind them and into my eyes. It was crazy, man. Yeah. So many experiences. And I didn't document any of it. It's all just, it's all just, yeah. Because I was disassociated from it. Yeah. Very disassociated. Weird. I have one picture of me in my, my garb.
He was on, he was on Facebook? Yeah. yeah. I didn't yeah. know yeah. all flannel. And no, muscles. I wasn't a lumberjack. <laughs> Not the typical. Yeah. Yeah. Way lumberjack. less, way less cool than that. I wonder if I could find it on here. Did you have a beard at the time? I, did, I was growing it out. See, this is what I'm talking about right here, this shadow you got going. This, this is, is like perfect, the four-day right? shadow. Yeah, yeah that's, is, what, that's what looks better. I think so, too, actually. I'd be good for pictures if I only felt like... I weighed myself too, yeah. and I'm weighing like in the 170 range, or I don't know. All right. Well, what do you think about my idea of having some kind of almost black metal obscurity photo, where it's just like you That's can tell cool. two guys are in the well, woods, but well, you don't. Won't you know, that be a little bit too impersonal? Associated with black metal. <laughs> <laughs> nice. With the orange. Is this like hat. is this like glowing reflector? Yeah, suit? that's what we nice. have there. It's all dirtied up. And where was this? What what town? This was in um, Amherst, I think or? Chesapeake. Chesapeake, closer to Virginia Beach. Yeah, that's hours away. It's like four four and a half hours away. How, why were you we, there? We traveled there twice a week. I mean, we lived out of a hotel. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Yeah, it wasn't until after yeah. I left that job that I ended up working more close to here. Was this before? This was would have been before you were in the Thai restaurant. Actually, after. How was that? So. It was a long distance for a while. Oh, okay. So how it worked was um, the time frame was the time restaurant I was working at Frito Lay at the same time. Yeah. I left Frito Lay and you had just post. joined that when we stopped talking. Frito Lay at the yeah. Post Around time. January of two thousand sixteen. Sixteen. Yeah. yeah. January, February, I think. It was mm -hmm. around that time. Um, and then I I joined the Thai restaurant in end of March, early April, 2017. Okay. 2017. And then, there until September 2017. So you usually hold jobs for like a year? Or uh, that was only a few months. That was like four or five the months. The set? Uh, no, that was the, uh, the Thai. Thai restaurant. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and then, <laughs> it got complicated. And, yeah. Yeah. and then, the reason why I, um, I left here is because she closed the shop down. But we still maintain a relationship. Really? Afterwards. Okay. Why was it closed down? Just as a competition and whatnot? She, uh, well, the lease was renewed and it would have been like a thousand dollars more. Yeah. And she lost all her help, so it was just her and I in the restaurant. It yeah. was a romantic time. Really? Just two of us holding it together. Her husband was too busy off working and her, uh, her kids were always in daycare. So it is kind of a romantic around. image, though. It Sounds is. like a, a the movie. Two of us <laughs> you disappeared into it yourself. Is, it was very beautiful, man. Uh, I remember staying in for super long days. And we would cuddle up and watch movies on Netflix in the restaurant itself after hours. That was our haven. That really? Was paradise. It was just like a scene. Yeah. Uh, no, we used to die. Oh, okay. And so. Is there anything else you want to say? Uh, <laughs> I don't know. What were you going to say? Is there anything else um, you want to say in regards to things I can avoid? Is my body image? Hmm? Is my body image? Yeah. Um, is, or just general to make music. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah.
most days. What did she say about that, though? Is it, like, does she know that that's... She knows that that's a thing, and she, she... I don't know. Does she eat it up, or does she... <laughs> <laughs> As do I. I mean, sometimes when I get off of work, she'll, she'll message me, and she'll be like, I'm actually still up, call me. Mm. And I'll call her, and we'll talk to her. And she's like... Oh, was that what happened today? No, actually, not yeah, it seemed like you got off a little later today. Usually when you message me, it's around like 5.08. Yeah, today was a little bit different. Um, I hope I hope you weren't annoyed by the fact that I was like... I tried to do the Facebook call. Oh. Because I figured um, that would... I didn't... It would have just like rang. I saw them. Calls, like two missed calls from you, but mm -hmm. I didn't hear them ever. Interesting. It might... They, it might have been while they were still in my locker. Okay, yeah. Yeah. I, I was I was only calling because at the time I was at a Wi-Fi hotspot in mm. Sheets. And I was being asked if I wanted to go out to get some sushi. And I would have to leave the hotspot for like an hour. So I was trying to do it real quick and figure it out before okay. I was out. Of I had to use someone else's phone to, 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 to finalize it later. Oh, yeah. no, 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 that's okay. I'm really sorry about that. I just want to make sure that I don't know how it's being interpreted because I can f I always feel like I'm being a pest when I'm trying to be the one like making sure are we still on? Is this is this happening? Mm -hmm. I feel like a mosquito. I don't yeah. want to make you feel that way. So we gotta find a way to communicate. Well, it I also helps if I know that that's not. Can you get forward? Uh, yeah, I want to find a way. To Sometimes I don't, I'm, I've lived so, not impulsively, kind of impulsively, for a while. And without commitment. Without commitment, for yeah. a while. So, my, I'm still kind of recovering from this, but this whole Or adjusting life, to the, you yeah. know. Well, even, even that, but I'm, in terms of recovery, this whole relationship with this woman prior, um, was one where she wasn't often available, but when she was, I had to make myself available. Hmm. I drop whatever I was doing. I would even leave band practice or leave wherever Damn. I was at to go be with her. So I had to be readily available at all times. Okay. So that was a kind of it was very very unstable. Well, what happened? You said you're recovering from that, but what happened after that? Was there a sense of I want my freedom back? I want to not. Did yeah, you rebel it, against it hasn't that? Been long since then. But, but did you like rebel against change. that feeling of having to? I don't know, the way you said recover, I, I, I wonder. Don't, I don't have the structure yet, so I'm still in the process of recovery. Okay. But yeah, I would ideally like to be like, all right, so Monday from this time to this time, this okay. is what I'm doing, from this time to this time, this is what I'm doing. Tuesday, I want to have more structure, because I feel like that would allow for balance. Right now, everything kind of feels like it's, like, I'm hitting all the points, but I'm not hitting them as efficiently as I could be. Okay. I'm not getting enough sleep. I find myself falling asleep in class and stuff Damn. like that. I'm trying not to. Here's the thing with like my, my side of things. If if you need to cancel, cancel. If, if things are still on, they're still on. But it's just the indeterminate. The indeterminate. That drives me nuts. That's, that's part of my even MBTI makeup. It's needing to... It's part of being in control of myself. And part of... Well, it also... I mean sometimes telling me that it's cancelled then I could go on and make other plans or continue right. on with my night so it's not just like I'm going to be here pissed off at you I mean I just I get to move on and get to do something productive but I totally suck when I think something's about to happen mm -hmm. I sit by the phone by the window I'm one of those yeah. introverts that don't get out much I wanted to ensure that I yeah. still can Okay. I know. I hope you don't feel like you're obligated. I am obligated because I told you this. You look like fucking Serge Tankian with that shirt on. Really? Yeah. I was I was actually gonna ask you like, what do you think about? I got this a few months ago, but I it's really, um it's I Indian. Really like it. So I wonder, like, to Curtis. Have you heard of Curtis? Mm -hmm. uh, K U R T A. And I've I've liked them since I was. I think you, even even apart from the whole video I thing, I feel like you could pull it off. People would think you're Indian. Though. I, have I have something that I like to wear. I wonder if I can. Is it like a Henley neck like that? 
With these buttons, then the it's like not a V neck, but it's yeah, it's yeah, not a V neck. But, yeah. th but this one's thermal, mm -hmm. and also has like these shoulder pads. It looks very sci fi. Really? Really? Is it like gray? It's black with gray. Um, because when someone describes sci fi, it's Yeah, yeah. It's Dude, I need something like that myself. Only it was it was like black on black, but it, but yeah, there was this, and it was a weird fabric. The material for the shoulders mm -hmm. was almost like it made a sound. It like rustled when you touched it because it was. Might be the same thing actually. I feel like mine was a little bit. I think I think I got mine from my uncle, so it might, but it might be a different. I got mine from New York. Okay. From a little outlet store. Hmm. I'm trying to find a picture with it. 